What is one piece of advice you would give to the graduating seniors? Please read. Please be a reader. Please, I don't even, I don't even really care what you read. Um, novels, they could be magazines, I don't care, just read. Because reading alone is incredibly important. So even if it's not super academic, like novels and books, just read and be a reader. What is one piece of advice you would give to the graduating seniors? Piece of advice that I have for the graduating seniors is, it's a long, hard road out there. So stay true to yourself and who you are and you'll never have to look back. What is one piece of advice you would give to the graduating seniors? Uh, there is a poem by Max Ehrman entitled Desiderata. I would say to find it, read it, and absorb it, and do the best you can to live by it. What is one piece of advice you would give to the graduating seniors? Uh, that would be uh, enjoy life, work hard, and play hard. What is one piece of advice that you would give to the graduating seniors? I think one piece of advice would be to practice empathy always. One of my favorite quotes from Plato is, the highest form of knowledge is empathy, for it requires us to suspend our egos and live in another's world. So empathy is caring for others and taking care of others. What is one piece of advice you would give to the graduating seniors? couple things off the top of my head. Well, actually, I thought about this. Uh, I think that you should laugh a lot. Uh, not, not everything is serious. It's not all life or death. Learn to laugh at yourself. And the other thing I think would be to, to forgive, to not hold grudges, to, be, to get past things and put them behind you. It, it helps in your marriage, it helps in your work relationships. So those two things, laugh and, and also forgive. What is one piece of advice you guys would give to the graduating seniors? I'll go first. You're going to have many jobs in your life. Try to find something that you can make a living with, that you're happy, and that you can laugh and enjoy yourself then it's not a job, but you got to still put food on the table, so that's my advice. My advice is chase your dreams, never give up, right? Whatever you want to be, you can be. You just have to put hard work and persevere. What is one piece of advice you would give to the graduating seniors? I always say life is too short to read bad books, and I still firmly believe that. But as you move on in your careers and your life, also remember life is too short to spend eight hours a day at a job you really, really hate. Find a job you love, have fun with it, you'll have a lot better work experience. What is one piece of advice you would give to the graduating seniors? I think that it would be like, well, I, several. Uh, I think number one, you've got to stay young. Like, age is just a number, it's all about your attitude, and so you need to listen to modern music and don't get stuck in like this time of your life. Like, move on quickly. Um, and, and then I would probably say travel, and travel now. Like right now, you have all the strength and all the energy. Make it work, save your money, go to Europe, go to China, go to all the places that you've always wanted to see for several reasons. One, they might not be here very soon. And two, like that's when you're gonna enjoy it the most. That's when you're gonna have the most freedom and you're gonna learn the most. And it's gonna, and finally, you, you need to be a part of this world. Don't sit back and just complain about what's going on in politics and society in your own life. You have to be an active participant. So watch the news, read books, um, have deep conversations with your friends, and then take action, do something about it. Again, it's like, Youth is, there's a saying, youth is wasted on the young because you don't know how great you have it right now. But that's true, you have all the energy. You have unlimited resources to you right now. So 
do it. Go out, make action, change the world, make it better.